hi guys so this was the morning before i moved out i forgot to insert this clip in a video before but it's here so i told my mom i didn't have a couch and she opted to like get it for me then i can refund her cash later which i'm so grateful for thank you thank you mom so i opted for this blue couch which was more of my vibe i loved it then later we we'll passed by dollar furniture to go and get my bed let me tell you this place has the worst <laughs> customer service ever we had to wait for more than an hour or 45 minutes for these guys to like remove the bed for me i had already paid them no they didn't see my the, the need to treat me in a nice way then i asked them to wrap the bed for me and they're like no we don't wrap beds for people it's two thousand shillings if you want and i was like you guys are mad uh -uh, i'm not paying 2k bought cling film and brought it for them to wrap it for me because you guys are not gonna play with me i dashed out money for this bed you're gonna wrap it went home that's my dad my mom and the guy who was carrying stuff for me and they packed everything this was one of the most hectic days enjoy this vlog guys i'm sending him Hi guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Liz Kamal. If you're new here, Karibu Karibu Sana. Today we are doing my first ever shopping haul for my house. I hope you guys enjoy this. I enjoy watching these kind of vlogs. And let me tell you, moving out is expensive. <laughs> it can be crazy. It's actually very crazy. It's hectic. It's draining at some point. And let me tell you, right now with this house like economy, everything is expensive. I bought this stuff and looking at the receipt, I'm still in shock. I'm living alone and all this stuff, and there's some stuff I didn't get in the supermarket, were almost 6,000 and something. Lord, please. But anyway, I'm glad I made this move. So I'll start with the food stuff. Uh, first, I went. Uh, I bought my coffee. You know, I like coffee. Then I got some tea bags. I mostly take tea bags at night. Then coffee maybe in the morning. I'm during the day. Then I got some Wheater Bix. These ones were on offer. Can't remember how much they are though. Wheater Bix and cornflakes. Then I got some toothpaste. This is one of my favorite toothpaste. And the other one from Colgate that is Optic White or something. Though it's very expensive, guys. I'm on a budget. I'm living on a budget. I have rent to pay. I have bills to pay. Can't afford to buy Colgate Coptic. Optic at the moment. 600 bob. No, please. Then I got some Indomie. That's on days where I don't want to cook. Uh, I got some spices. I basically just got spices that we use at home. I got some black pepper, mixed spices, uh, chilies. I got some garam, garam masala. I also got cinnamon, mostly for the pancakes. Uh, some garlic powder and some coriander. So this I have I got the blue band. I don't use this, but my friend and also my boyfriend use this, so that's why I got it. Uh, I also got some peanut butter. This is one of my favorite peanut butter. I also love the blue band one, but I'm living on a budget. <laughs> I guess it goes for 250 bob and the blue band one it usually goes for like 400 bob no unless my mom is buying it probably then i also got some salt so i just got the small one i got some soy sauce uh i got some pasta i'm a spaghetti then i got some sugar okay you just i feel like eat and last for months so i got this this is one of my favorite because we also use it at home and got some cooking well up and a couple of wells niko kwa supermarket kwa sababu why why is cooking oil so expensive hey three liter i think i got it for i don't know if it wasn't 900 it was 800 and something got self raising flour this one i got it for my pancakes uh I got some soko maize meal, yaugali. I'm so sure we expect to buy a chapati. I don't know how to cook chapati, excuse me. Got this velvet air freshener. It was mainly influenced by Nora and it smells really, really good. Uh, I got some nice and lovely body lotion. This lotion, 
is exactly what it thinks it is i also have uh they, they are that kabluka thing i'll show you guys i might go and get it let me show you so i normally use this two on my body this one is damn expensive this small cup bottle goes for like 200 and something but this lotion is very pocket friendly and it does the job i love it and i love how it smells how it smells these two combo my current favorite i also got some arimis for my lips maybe my hands here and there i got some pads um panty liners i opted for geisha so i got the traditional black soap the mo moringa oil and the shea and almond butter i got some toothbrushes i got this is toilet cleaner let me tell you i looked at happy price and i salute my mother for always buying us happy because what is that price hey lord no not now now i am mr pesa then i got this sunlight uh dishwashing soap next i got this again influenced by nora the velvet cream hand wash i got these toothpicks i got i mean I, I don't have a reason why i got these two conditioner and shampoo i just feel they were cheap you know i got this meningai soap this is for doing my laundry then this one is for doing my dishes uh i got this cascotch bright i got some water then i got some toast and last but not least i got some toilet toilet paper oh i forgot to show you i got this casoda and some these are actually my favorite biscuits or cookies the fairyland chocolate chip cookies so the other stuff that i got that are not food stuff uh, i got this ironing box uh, with time i think i'll buy that what do we call it ile ya kutumia mkono wacha pasi the other one yeah. with time i think i'll buy a steamer but right now i'll just go with the iron box because i sell coats and also i can't leave the house with creased clothes so most of this stuff i actually bought von because von had an offer i bought my electronics from power star i got this car stuff it's car portable dispenser something just all the electronics that i bought in the house are von other thing that i got is this kettle it's also from von and this one i think i got it for if it's not 1600 it was 1500 because our price hi guys there's some stuff i didn't get in my nearest supermarket so i decided to go to kafo today just get everything that i want so that when i start the week i can just start settling in so i got quite a few things and let me tell you things are expensive lot these two these two papers literally costed me 3k and when you see what's in there let me this these and these are not part of my home. Uh, so, and I think I, so I got some snacks. Guy, they may pass I got some crackles. The whole shopping costed me 3913 I got some pink cakes, some muffins. Uh, I got this uh, bio blueberry on the bottom yogurt this is just a treat actually got some ilara plain yogurt i usually use this to cook my chicken then i got some beef sausages i got two vanilla ilara yogurt i don't take milk i also don't like yogurt that much but i don't like taking my cereals or my conflicts or my wheat mixed with milks these are actually my favorite crisps the matoke the amigos uh matoke crisps the salted one but these cookies these cookies <laughs> they're exactly what they think they are uh they're the coconut flavored ones i got some tomato sauce some chili sauce beef cubes i got this this is what i lacked yesterday actually i got this festive vanilla essence this one is for my pancakes 
so I got some paprika I just realized I didn't get this I got some honey I got this milk just in case I get a visitor and they take milk and also I use some milk in my pancakes I got some tomato paste on to the next one I got some vim this one is mostly for cleaning my toilets I got this shower gel. I'm currently using the Dove shower gel. So I got this. Then I have two bathrooms. Just in case I get a visitor, at least there is a shower gel to use in this common bathroom. Then I also got this for my common bathroom. I don't know if you guys can remember. Yesterday I got the S1. It was going for 250 bob. I think I'm going to be going to Carrefour for my shopping because there is variety. But I don't think I'm going to be going to Carrefour to shop on a Sunday. Mm-mm. 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 It was too packed. It was even scary. <laughs> then this hurricane one, I think I got it for 80 bob. If I'm not wrong, it was very cheap. And the fact that I live alone, guys, I think that's very, very cheap. Yeah, it was going for 87 bob. Then I got this astonish multi surface cleaner i want to use this mostly in the kitchen i think i'm gonna go back and get the one for um, carpets and couches uh, i got these sodas they were going on offer so i got this four liter pack 1.25 liter pack for 474 last but not least I got my wines. I got this Fourth Street Sweet Wine White. I got this Leleshwa White Sweet Wine as well. This is actually one of my favorite wines. And I guess that's it. This is what costed me today 3,900 and something. Huh? I'm still in shock. Minus the wines. Let me tell you, living alone is slowly, slowly shocking me. So that's it for my haul today. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I am so energetic to shoot a lot of vlogs. Right now that I have my own space and I can just shoot in the middle of the night, in the morning, at night. Like, you know, it's hard to shoot when you're living with people because you have to consider that maybe some people are sleeping you have to consider that some people are watching something and you don't want to keep telling people shh, 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 you know but now when i'm living alone i feel like i can shoot anytime i can do a lot of stuff you know so anyway thank you so much guys for watching this vlog i hope you guys are continuously enjoying my uh moving out vlogs please make sure to like share and subscribe we're on our way to 3000 subscribers bye bye and see you on my next one